It was here that art and energy was first created. But you had to fuck it up. <laughs> God, is there a whole other level after this before the level I'm thinking of? There might be. Unless that's all one level like they did in some... Hmm, could be. I'm glad this game is as long as it is. Oh yeah. I think it's much longer than Doom 2016. Doom 2016 isn't super short, but it's over before you know it. Because it's intense! Mm -hmm. Do you still think... Uh, like, you, you said you were leaning towards 2016 being the better one? Do you no, I said one? I was leaning towards this being the oh, better really? one. Because okay. I think this one has a more satisfying combat gameplay loop. loop. Yeah, right. combat loop. Yeah. Alright, we're back. Welcome back, everybody. <laughs> Big green button. We killed her again. Just as she deserved. True. True dat. Oh. <laughs> oh, we never did do that one challenge. Nah, you had to get a special kill on the Doom Hunter. Yeah, I don't care. Yeah, I think it was enough just to kill them. Plus, it's just a rewards you with a battery, so whatever. You think you still have, like, ten of those? Yeah, I don't know what to do with them. Nothing is the answer. The answer is to play through the game not worrying too much about them. Which, I guess, Breath of the Wild also does that with its Korok seeds. I wish they just came up front, but, like, you're going to be given plenty of these. Just go for the ones that you like. Form a back glory kill on a tyrant. Form a left side glory kill on the Archville. Kill more than one enemy with a single blood punch five times. Okay. Ascend the Soul Spire. Oh, this is gonna be fun. We must make our way through and to the top where the pure argent energy is exported directly to Earth. Find that pure argent energy, Sid. Samuel Hayden must be really happy because he gets to talk about argent energy again. <laughs> but this is where it comes from. And I think in a way it makes the first game a little bit better. In what way? Like, Argent Energy was very abstract in the last game, but this level is, like, the Argent Energy factory that you never saw. You just saw it being, like, processed and used in the last game. Well, they didn't know where it was coming from in the last game. Uh... They were like, it's from hell. Oh, yeah, I guess they didn't really know. The makers know. This is a much later on. I don't know how much later I don't know why. Really. Well, Samuel Hayden had time to recreate his thing and then take over the planet. Uh, he was already the ruler of the planet, actually. Oh, was he? Yeah. If I had to guess, this is like two to five years after the first one. There's probably an exact number. I learned something earlier today. What did you something learn? Something sad, but also encouraging. Mm -hmm. uh, the Tyranids have not gotten a new model since 2014. Wow. Well, so maybe the they'll Necrons get updated were similar. Soon. Yeah, that's what I was like. Maybe they'll get updated soon, and they can be my oh, your other army. My can, other other army. You can have your family ship them to Japan for you. I don't have them anymore. Huh? I, I thought you kept them. them. Oh, I sold them. Oh, I didn't know you sold them. I did oh. the same thing you did with your orcs. Ah, uh, did you keep any of them? Uh, probably. Yeah, I think I kept uh this Oops. one. Custom... I forgot that was gonna get. Do you remember my custom uh? A lot work of the... with the big blaster with the like Tesla coil, Tesla triangle looking thing on it. Yes. Yeah, I think I kept that one, and I kept my orc and Terminator army who had the bib that said "Get some." Uh -huh. <laughs> the problem with the, a lot of the Tyranid models of that time is that most of them were still metal. Ugh. So like all the Zone Thropes, all the Hive Guard, all the Venom Thropes, all their like cool units, other mm -hmm. than like. Um, Mawiles and Carnifexes were not. Uh, but, like, I don't think they would have released... Ah, shit. Yeah, that's a refill, so you can just jam it. I don't think they would have re ever released models of those that were not plastic, because mm -hmm. they're big. I would like to see a 40k uh, shooter with the same gameplay loop as Doom. <laughs> I mean, actually... It feels like it's sort of made for it. Yeah, Sp Space Marine uh, kind of... I don't know if it originated, but it definitely had that trend where you, like, you kill enemies to get health back. So if you're low on health, you need to get more aggressive. 
Mm-hmm. You know, not start turtling. Oh, or... hey, it's... I haven't seen these guys in a while. Yeah, that's because they're really pathetic in this game. They're they're a serious threat in the, the last one. Based on, like, above normal. Oh, hey, it's these guys, too. Mm-hmm. It's been a while since we saw any of them. Yeah, <laughs> using any gun except for that takes it forever. With this one, they're just, they're just down. I was trying to get him into glory kill me. Yeah. Oh, hey, that crucible thing you have. <laughs> Can you shoot through that? Yes. Sure can. Huh. How about that? Weapon point acquired. Oh, they put stuff all over this room. Do you remember like the, the, the barrier doors in Devil May Cry? No. You walk close to them, and there'd be this hand that came out. And smacked you. And it had this sound like, wah, wah, and it would like hit you if you got too close to it without having the right number of orbs, or if it wasn't Look, time I for got you to it open anyway. the door. Nice. Yeah, if it wasn't time for you to open the door. Mm -hmm. Those things used to scare the shit out of me. <laughs> like, it might have been connected to me thinking the wall masters in Ocarina of Time were fucking terrifying. I hated the Forest Temple because of that. I used to, whenever I would like replay that game as a kid, I would get to the Forest Temple and I'd ask my brother to play through it. And then I'd pick up the game after he finished it for me. Just because having those wall masters suddenly appear, a shadow under you, and if they take you, like, they don't actually do any damage, but like, you're forcibly dragged away from where you are. Yeah, it's scary. Yeah, just completely out of your own control. It fucked, it, it terrified me, something about that. Yeah, they, well, they're cr fucking creepy. Yeah. Just like a dead fucking hand that touches you. Is there something you need to say? <laughs> Maybe this isn't the best format. <laughs> nah, nothing like that. Maybe it's just having control taken away from you. It terrified me as a kid, I don't know. I mean, it is scary. Yeah, I was a kid that really, really needed, like schedule and routine. In kindergarten, one time, they, like, changed the schedule up, and I started crying during parts of the day, and no one understood why. <laughs> they eventually found out it's just because the schedule of the school had changed. Ooh! <laughs> I hope that was a mad snipe you were going for. Oh! Oh! The speed one was right next to you. I just see it. Ooh, neat. I think that's the speed one. Is that the invulnerability one? No, this is the speed one. The only nice one is the, uh... The quad damage? Or the oh, okay, quad damage one. is pretty cool, but the the rampage one, where you go full melee, that's the best one. Makes fights a little bit Oh, this is the though. unlimited ammo one. Huh? Is it? Well, I saw... I don't think so. Oh, I saw, like, an... No, your rocks simple. definitely went from four to zero. I thought I saw a thing. Mm. Oh, man, remember how the suit points in the first game, um... They would upgrade your power-ups. Does that matter? <laughs> such a bad investment. Like, you don't even know if you're going to see power-ups for any of the next levels. Your people are made to... Like, any points that you put into that, if you did collect everything, would just be a waste in the ending. <laughs> you're going full force, huh? Oh, okay. Not all full force. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck <laughs> is. Well, I don't know what what is happening right now, but it's cool. Yeah, man. It's not one of those. I was just trying to shoot it a bunch. <laughs> the sake I'm drinking is pretty smooth. Almost worryingly smooth. Like, I'm just gonna drink a couple cups and realize I'm fucked up. I made, I made a whoops. Oh shit. 
Oh shit. What was knocking me back? Um. <laughs> you don't know. Sorry. That's okay. It was the snakes. Yeah. You just say that whenever anything happens. That's because so. the snakes suck. I hate the snakes. They're make be snakes. <laughs> <laughs> I want that shirt. Yeah, me too. I'm pretty sure she had it custom made. She did. This is probably something I can do for you. There, there must be a way. But Josh, what are we going to do? You can't go around the island. They make these snakes. Did you ever write fan fiction, Sid? Oh yeah. What did you write about? Uh, I wrote a few different. Like what? Uh, what was the the fandom? Uh, shoot. What did I? I would guess you would write about Doctor Who. Why? I'm just joking. Um, God. No, I had a, a couple of anime that I did back in the day. Yeah, an anime would, would, would suit you, I think, but... Is there any video game property that you ever did? Um, I'm pretty sure I did... Because sometimes I, I just like to do them for, like, giggles. Uh-huh. I'm trying to remember. If there's anything, I would, I would say it'd be like a toss-up between, like, Zelda... Uh, I don't know. For some reason, Halo is striking me for some reason. Well, it really depends on what kind of, like, thing you want to write. Like, mm. what are you going for? Uh, I want to put a character who looks exactly like me, and is also named Shane, and I want him to go and just bang all the hottest characters in a game I like. Okay. I don't know if that's ever been covered in fanfiction before. <laughs> That was not the guy I meant, but... <laughs> I think that's actually a good time for it. What was that? What was the anime? I was joking, by the way. What was the anime? Um... What was the... Uh... Oh! I'm, doom, 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 I, I'm having a hard time thinking. <laughs> Give me a few minutes. Alright. Whoop! Whoop, 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 whoop. Like that. Oh, nice, you have blood punch too. Uh, that was nice. Nice. Wrong button! Oh shit, you're gonna die! Yeah, I pressed the wrong button. Oh man. Uh, the anime was a certain scientific railgun, which is based on a series of light novels. Or it's a spin Is that seriously the name? Yeah. A certain scientific railgun? Yeah, because it's based off a light novel, and all those light novels have really stupid names. Huh, okay. Um, but I did it because a friend of mine did, and then I met a bunch of people who also did that story. Uh-huh. And it's fun because it's sort of like X-Men, mm -hmm. because it's just like you, you've you got like a setting, people have random superpowers, and then you throw them at each other. Okay. Um... And there's a whole, like, conspiracy plot in the background of the show that never gets resolved. Hmm. So it really encourages people to come up with fan theories. Okay. I did that for a couple of years um, with a couple of my friends um, that I met through that. Like, uh, my Aomori friend is someone I met through that. Oh, okay. And she just left yesterday. Hmm. Or today, I guess. Um, left Japan, basically? Yeah. Like, she's down here? Yeah. I, I can't was like, understand that. But, hmm? I can't understand, like, coming for five whole years mm -hmm. and then just going back. Well, I mean, it... Like a year or maybe two years, I get, but that's a long time, half a decade. Well, I mean, I guess it makes sense. Like, it makes sense for her situation for okay. a few reasons. Uh -huh. Also, um, I mean, like, it's easier when you just, like, have to re-sign a contract and say, yeah. Yeah. Then if, like... Time some... can slip away. Like, somebody, like, asks you, like, now, because, like, Jet, like, its limit is five years, right? Yeah. And so now she's, like, actually got to, like, consider it. Hmm. And, like, Jet is, like, pretty easy in the sense that, like, it's harder for them to hire a new person than to keep you on, usually. Yeah, yeah. So, like, if you want to keep doing it, you usually can. Hmm. You glad you're not a Jet anymore? Uh, sometimes. Hmm. 
usually. For those that don't know, JET is the kind of most common teaching program for foreigners in Japan, where you actually work for the government and go to different prefectures. I don't know if it's the most common. There's uh, tons of them. It's the most well-known. There are lots of them, but... Uh, good here. choice. Good choice. There are lots of different ones. Um, I, I was never a JET personally. And um, my experience being a JET and being a, a teacher at any other school is very different. Yeah. Um, a lot of the times... It, it really depends on the school that you... Oh, shit, right. Um, the school you end up in. I think it's coming for you. Um, basically, if you end up at a super high-level school, mm -hmm. um, you're probably not going to do very much mm -hmm. because you're basically there as, like, a feather in the cap. <laughs> like, yes, we have an ALT. Yes, they're a JET, which is the, like, quote-unquote good one. Uh -huh. But it's only the good one because we're the most vetted. Hmm. Um... In term, not in terms of like teaching qualifications, but in terms of like, are you gonna be super creepy? Because <laughs> um, Jet does have an issue with that, but I know people who work for like Interact and other, those kinds of places, and it's a much bigger problem. Oh really? Yeah, just because they don't oh, yeah. really care. They're just like, yep, we'll hire you. Uh, how should I start this fight? I guess this is fine. Super shotgun. That's not true. Just every little guy super shotgun them. And you'll, have, you'll, be, you'll be swimming in armor. You want to super shotgun this guy? Not that one, but there's tons of little guys around here. Oh, yeah, that. Being a pain. Just the more time you use it, the more armor is up. It's like whenever your armor is less than 50. Super shotgun. Whee! <laughs> it really is fun. I wonder, is this a good thing to save until... Aha! Oh, he doesn't want to die, Sid. <laughs> too bad for him. Yeah, too bad for him, indeed. Hmm. I spy a pain elemental. Oh. Woof. Sudden instant transition made me think you died. run it's hard to tell <laughs> who knows yeah I can turn in an instant there he is yeah you don't have too much other resistance to distract you oh I think he's ready it's a shame that's not enough to just instantly knock him off it'd be so cool oh oh nice is he dead I think he's dead. Don't, don't blow yourself up, man. They, one of those teleporters just like you got in front of me. <laughs> you gotta regret that now. Cool. You did it. Well done, my man. We are climbing this soul spire at quite the pace. Boom! <laughs> nice. Alright, well, we're gonna keep on. Keep on. Soul climbing. Next time. Next time. That's right. Woo! Wee! <laughs> Let's do a flippy flippy. Wait, I wonder. Uh huh. Wee! 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 <laughs> oh. I mean, I think that refreshes your jump. <laughs> <laughs>